People who earn more ask. Ask, ask, ask. Asking is a massive form of action. Typically, you'll notice if someone's moved around in different companies over time, they tend to earn more because there's always that conversation at the recruitment and selection phase of, you know, what are you looking for? So there's a negotiation that can happen organically. If you're in the same job though for a while, having that conversation can be more tricky, especially if you don't have annual reviews. They don't exist everywhere anymore. The most important thing is to understand what your role is being paid in the market. Again, everything is market research. Understand kind of where you it. If you think it's too low, you're probably right. You really get that information, be equipped with it. Understand why you're good at what you do. I mean, that's the other thing. People will just remember their mistakes. They made a mistake on a report four months ago and then still feel sick about it. That's just going, well, I grew the team and I increased profit and I streamlined this process and I bring a lot of value to the office in terms of my attitude. So really being able to uh, understand your value as an employee, doing the research, knowing what other people like you are getting paid. Those two things are really critical. And then you just have to ask, you have to set up a conversation with your boss and go for it. I mean, think about it. A few minutes of an awkward conversation over time, like what, how that will compound like your income, it's absolutely worth it. Actually, I love what Tim Ferriss says about this. He says that a successful person can almost be measured by the number of uncomfortable conversations they're willing to have. That conversation, those few minutes, when you think about the upside versus the downside, it's absolutely worth doing.